at the end of last year, you you also came and visited this little island down at the bottom of the bottom of the globe. Um, what was your kind of like? Was it your first time to Australia? Yeah, that was my first time. And and what was your uh, kind of first impressions? You know, it, I, as soon as we got out of the airport and like you take a step outside, um, I was like, man, it's like Hawaii. Well, that and was going to be my next question. Cleaner. Like, how does it compare to to Hawaii as well? Like, yeah, so it, it's it's a lot cleaner than Hawaii is. Um, smells a lot fresher as well. <laughs> Uh, I'm not saying Hawaii is dirty, but it's just it just seems like people in Australia just take care of their their land better, you know. Like, um, I feel like Hawaii is so small, and the tourists just take overtakes the island that you know it kind of we take away from appreciating our land. Like Hawaiians are always been very very appreciative of the land, you know, taking care of the the aina, which is the land, and. So, like, going to Australia, I was like, oh, man, this is awesome. Like, I totally moved here. <laughs> like, that was literally my first first thought. It was like, oh, I, if I ever had to, like, leave the country, I'm moving to Australia. Like, and I still feel the same way. Um, it's the beaches are nice. The people are awesome. I, I love Aussies, man. They're just straightforward, fun people. And um, I actually am, like, got pretty, really close with one of the guys that's out there that trains at a Igor's and like he's one of the one of my favorite dudes I've ever met too so I, I mean I've only met him for like I hung out with him like three days so I, I love Australia and you just the weather is awesome it's it's just a big hoy 